cleaning out your lightning bunnies, but they aren't just lightning bunnies. They could be USB-C bunnies and those sorts of things. And we got some great comments from many, 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 many of you, including a cool stuff found revisited, but really enhanced from Ben. And uh, he sends us a, a link for the pure port, which is something we've talked about uh, on the show in the past, but in the past it was only uh, the pure port was only available for lightning connectors. Now it's available also for USB C connectors and it's a multi-tool for cleaning those connectors. And it's got all the right uh, shapes and sizes to not only clean the port on your devices, but to clean the connector on the cables as well. Cause the USB C cables have that little, you know, gunk collector in the middle of them so it's kind of got it's got it all in one it looks like a, it's a fun little multi-tool it's available on amazon for 25 bucks and the lightning version is also available on amazon for 25 bucks so you can you could buy both but uh, but then it would cost you 50 bucks because that's how math works and at least in my world so <laughs> thank you for sending that in ben good stuff love it yep Hey, Dave. Hey, Adam. We can't let them get away with blocking all of our charging. If we give in, we're giving in to all the cute and fuzzy lightning bunnies in the world. And so Kirit has the solution for us. And that is? He says, I enjoyed your interesting discussion on cleaning lightning bunnies. At one point, I heard one of you saying that something about how difficult it would be to clean USB ports. I bought this Chinese made set on Amazon that did the job and I lo- love this stuff. So I'll explain what this is in a minute, but I got to give you the, I got to give you the title of this thing. iPhone cleaning kit for charging port, multi 10 in one Android cleaner kit, phone cleaning tool repair for iPhone and type C data cable, camera, earbud, speaker, electronic screen, portable storage case. You think they keyword stuffed that title at all, Adam? <laughs> <laughs> Love it. Love it. This is a Giga Oge? Giga Oge? Gia Oge? G I A O G E. I don't know. Yeah. Don't it doesn't know. matter. There's there's a bunch of these. There's a bunch of these kits. This one happens to kind of be cool because it looks like a little uh, AirPods case almost. Yeah. And then within it, it has all of these little tools for getting in cracks and crevices. It looks like little felt cleaners. There's kind of a. a pen looking like thing that there's a little brushy kind of thing and it you know looks just like a thing for like digging things out of cracks and crevices i might be a little bit careful in some areas on your devices Especially with some metal. of these tools so you'll have to figure out what the right tool is for the right like place but huh. yeah it, just a little bunch of little bits and bobs in a nice little uh case Chris brings us the uh, Magnalink 360 Pro charging cables that also will help ward off lightning bunnies in their own way because what these are, for 30 bucks you get a 360 Pro 100-watt magnetic USB-C phone charger, pack of two, six-in-one magnet charging cable, fast charging, and data works with iProducts Type-C and micro USB forest green. Almost as long as the previous. I know. Yeah. Only one line shorter. That's right. But the idea is there, these are two part connectors and one part lives in your USB C port on your phone or on your Mac. And then the other, and it has a little a magnetic nub on the outside of it. And then the other part is the cable that has a re- reciprocal magnetic nub. Yeah. And so it just plugs right in. So you get essentially MagSafe ish yeah. and, and it'll save your lightning bunnies by nature of the port is always full. So you, it doesn't, it's not open when it's in your pocket and, and collects all the lint and all that stuff. So yeah, this is pretty interesting. And yeah, what, well- What's that, Adam? Sorry, I was going to say what I like about these, and I have a question about for people who have used them, is an issue we have in our house is that the cables always seem to break right at that 
point where the cable comes into the bottom of the connector, right? It, it, the wires, cause you turn your phone landscape mode and then the cord pulls down and blah, blah, blah. This has a, a mechanism that allows it to rotate like 90 degrees. I'm just curious, is that bet like, does that hold up better or does it have the same problem where eventually it just wears out because there's probably contacts sliding across one another? Like, mm. have people found that's better or worse or about the same? Like, I'm I'm curious because the only thing, that's the only thing about this is it's definitely a system and you're kind of locked into, you know, it's like the razor blade sort of thing. You're going to be locked into this brand of cable, right? Right. You're, right. you're not going to find these cables over at a, at a Anchor. No, no, you, you're on the MagnaLink or whatever other, there, there, it looks like, it looks like there there are many of these out there and the pictures of them make it look like it doesn't really matter what brand you buy from they're all using the same you know mag magnetic connector. Now whether you want to be the one to experiment with that on your devices or if you want to let it be someone else that's that's a you decision. Um yeah, that's interesting. Yeah, maybe Chris will write back in and and share that with us. 